you're going to tangle up half the boat. So what you want to do is take your time, look at it, and say, okay, I'm coming over you guys, or I'm coming over you and under you. That's how you follow your fish. Uh, we'll avoid a lot of tangles if we all follow our fish on the striper and work together moving our rods. As far as the halibut goes, we want a bouncing bottom. I know there's a couple minutes today, or a couple hours today, where we're going to be trolling for halibut. Uh, as far as the trolling goes, me and Nate, we'll start dropping everybody in off the get-go. But when it comes to dropping yourself in, what I want you guys to do while we're trolling, and the captain will say we're trolling, to drop in, you want to hug your rod tip right next to the boat that way you're not dropping on top of everyone else and then let it out till it hits bottom once it hits bottom you know stick it on the rod holder and make adjustments from there you want to be tapping bottom the whole time today in your rod tip and if you do get bit by a halibut let that thing eat i can't stress this enough to let the halibut eat uh they eat from the tail up if you start reeling right away, you're going to reel up a bait that's about scratch half the way down uh, every time. Really let it eat. When you know it's time to reel is when that rod tip starts digging. When the rod tip starts digging, you'll know that fish is on. Uh, the striper's a little different. They'll just pick it up and they'll, they'll be on in a blink of an eye. Uh, but yeah, other than that, as far as netting the fish goes, what I want you guys to do is reel it up all the way to the surface and keep it about that far under the water. And what I'll have you do is stay right up on the rail. Everybody wants to back away from the rail for some reason. What that does is it brings the fish next to the boat and I can't net it when it's next to the boat. So I Uh, striper mm -hmm. here right now or just a halibut? Striper. Striper? I just let it sit on the bottom. You don't want to bounce it on this one? Just let uh -huh. it sit? Just, just let, it, let sit. it sit. Okay. All these striper coming through here uh -huh. are feeding on the uh, on the crabs coming uh, through. So, gotcha. I mean, there's like little baby crabs down there and uh -huh. they're kind of just down there sucking them up. <laughs> You're a star, baby. Keep popping. Baby song. <laughs> Baby shark 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 shark. <laughs>
say it teaches you about discipline oh yeah yeah it's not just working out it, it's more than that like, yeah it, oh, it's a sure. body high it's it's life yeah when you it, get there and it's not even like it could be cleaning your house or, or using power drills or stuff yeah Thing's gonna get a concussion. <laughs> <laughs> it's too small. You have a number yet? Nope. That might be a keeper. Well, let me go measure it. It's close. a good deckhand. The one and only deckhand. Come on Zoe. Zoe girl.
Loosen your drag. Reel some of that in, throw some of it in. Yeah, reel some of it in. Oh, little guy. Let's give it a kiss before I throw it back. Oh, you got it. It's probably big shawl. You got one on right here? I think so. I had one that got away. Just leave it right there. Oh, yeah. That's a brilliant. Damn it, he got away. Please be ginormous. <laughs> what do you got? What do you got? Hit the dog. Big one. Oh, it's like a green flash from my face. All right. Good. All right. See that? <laughs> Marty Jr. Marty Jr. I'm not sure. I'll grab the net just Excuse me, guys. And then watch out for my back swing. Alright. <laughs> Get back Diaper. in it. Diaper? No, I'll net it. Big one? Nice. Yeah, that one is our cheaper. Yeah.